Hello everyone, today we're going to look at systematic listing and this is from B4 Heuristics. Okay, question 3. First, let's read the question. Ellie bought a tin of cookies. There are more than 20 but less than 40 cookies in the tin. If she packed them equally into packs of 3 cookies each, she will be left with 1 cookie. If she packed them equally into packs of 5 cookies each, the remainder will be 4 cookies. How many cookies are there in the tin? Next, we need to highlight or underline the keywords or phrases from this question. So the first key phrase is, there are more than 20 but less than 40 cookies. So we need to take note of that. Next, she packed them equally into packs of 3 cookies each. Then, Ellie will be left with 1 cookie. So this is the first condition in this question. So the second condition is if she pack them equally into packs of 5 cookies instead of 3, the remainder will then be 4 cookies. So we need to find how many cookies are there in the tin, the total number of cookies. Alright, so this is a listing question. So first, we draw a table with number of packs and because if they have one number of pack, there will be 1 times 3 cookies in the packets of 3 and because she will be left with 1 cookie so we're going to plus 1 a total number of 4 cookies so if there are 2 packs 2 times 3 will be 6 plus 1 will be 7 cookies total with 3 packs there will be 10 cookies altogether and we continue all the way to 10 packs and with 10 packs there are actually 31 cookies altogether. So from this table, we can see that we can take away pack 1 all the way to pack 6. Why? Because the second sentence says that there are more than 20 but less than 40 cookies. Alright, so with pack 1 to pack 6, there is less than 20 cookies. Alright, so we take away that column and erase it and they just include from pack 7 onwards. Alright, so we continue till pack 13. Alright, we continue to pack 13, 11, 12, 13, and we have a total of 34 cookies for pack 11, 37 cookies for 12 packs, and 13, 40 cookies for 13 packs. So we do take away 13 packs because there should be less than 40 cookies altogether. Alright, that will be for the first condition. So next, for the second condition, we need to draw another table below. If our with one pack will be multiplied by five because there are five cookies each in each pack. And remainder of four cookies means that we need to add four to find the total number. So with one pack, there will be a total of four cookies for the second condition. So for 2 packs, it will be 14 cookies, 3 packs will be 19 cookies. And the same thing as the first condition for the second table will be, so continue all the way to 8 packs in total, and you get uh, 44 cookies altogether. So because less than 40 cookies, you need to take away the 8 packs. So there should be up to 7 packs, possibility possible will be up to 7 packs with a total of 39 cookies. So for the first the two tables, okay the two condition, we got to match the total number of cookies, which means we need to match the last row in each table. And we can see that there should be a total of 34 cookies. The one matches in both tables. Alright, so there are total of 34 cookies all together. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Bye-bye.